How to integrate ChatGPT with Wix. Hello guys and welcome to this new tutorial. Today I'm going to show you how easy it is to integrate your favorite uh, open AI app which is ChatGPT within your Wix website. It is very easy and very simple. All you need to do is to follow up the tutorial from the beginning till the end and you are going to be good to go. The first thing that you need to do is to head over Wix.com. Then you're going simply to uh, here visit or select the website that you have here to work on and you want to add the chatbot to. For example, let's go ahead and use this one, which is Jack's Rental or any website. So don't get this uh, here example as uh, acquired, but you're going simply to visit the dashboard. Once the dashboard is hit it here already and also loaded, you're going to click on edit site. Then you're going to see here the website that you have. So here the first thing that you need to do is to get the link of your website because this is a very, very necessary uh, here, as you can see, a step. How you can do it, you're going to click on here or not hover only the mouse over the publish button. You're going to see here view site. You're going to click on it and then you are going to see the website. So all we need to do is to copy the website address or URL. But before that, I'm going to let this uh, here uh, window as it is. We are going to visit OpenAI and also we are going to visit a platform called Social Intents. And this Social Intents is going to be your go to uh, chatbots that can be created or AI chatbots that can be created live. So you are going to click on free trial. In my case, I have already an account. So we are going to use our account. Once you have here your account, you are going to set up the chat console. So we are going to set up the chat. I'm going to see here, uh, I'm going to click on add chat app. Here, head over right there, as you can see here. I have already uh, set uh, the chat console. So I'm going to deconnect the uh, account and sign it into another account. So here I have uh, made the decision to create a new account. As you can see, we're going to see here, welcome to live, uh, live chat here um, window or page. We have here a lot of choices. So we have the integration to add it to Microsoft Teams, Create a ChatGPT chatbot, which is the subject of today. Zoom, WebEx, uh, Google Chat, and etc. So we are going to create a chatbot with uh, the ChatGPT. And for here, we need our OpenAI API key for ChatGPT. How we can uh, do that, or how we can get it, we're going to head over to the OpenAI. Then we are going to head over the menu and for that, we are going to click on API login. Once you are here, you are going to set up here the API. Then we are going simply to head over the settings. Once you're on the settings, you're going to visit the profile. Then you are going to visit the API key at the top. So once you are here, you're going to create a new secret key. Then we are going to name it, for example, chat box. Then we are going to click on create new key. Copy that key, click on done. Boom, we are going to head over the uh, social intents. Then we are going to type in here the API key. The second thing is to head over here at the website or article URL. Go back to the Wix website. Copy and paste that specific URL into this specific area. Click on add. Boom, here we have the website added. Now, all we need to do is to see that we have the, um, as you can see here, the AI chats not trained. We're going to click on next. And then we are going to either here uh, put the or install the code snippet 
at the uh, closing body of your HTML. For example, you are going to head over the website. Then you are going to add or click on the developer mode. Turn on the developer mode. And then we are going to see if we can add it and see the body. Now we are going to wait and boom, here we have the uh, developer mode. So we are going to see here the uh, home. We're going to see here and see what do we have. We need only the, the header. So I don't know how to work with that but I am going to turn it off. This is the first thing for those who does know how to put that. But we are going to link directly to your chat bot. We are going to use the link below to put it right there. You can go ahead and use it as iframe, for example, like that. Or you can install the link directly by copying it. Going back to Wix, click on add element. Then we are going to click on embed code. Once you are here, you are going to click on embed a website. Then we are going to set here the website, click on apply. Boom. And here I have to mention something that in this case, and uh, also in this area, this is the live chat, as you can see. You need to get the open AI paid mode or the paid subscription because the pre mode will get some issues and also maybe it will not work correctly. So I'm going to click on publish. Then we are going to visit the website. So we are going to click on view site. Now we are going to see if it works. If it doesn't, that means that we need the premium one. So we are going to click on live chat. So here we have it. This is the start chat. You're going to put the name, the email, also the uh, question. Then you're going to type in a start chat. Boom, here we have it. For example, you're going to put, for example, right there. And here we have everything uh, resumed or concluded in just a few steps. You need to open up the AI, not the chat GPT. Get your settings and get your API key ready. Go to uh, social intents, create your chatbot, then get your embed code or the embed, as you can see here, link. Add it to Wix and here we have it. So that was all for today's video. Thank you guys for watching. I hope that you have enjoyed the content and hope to see you soon on the next one.